Episode 61. Bring me everything you have. Fix the computer without turning it on? This was the first time Aiden had heard of such a thing. Just as he was about to approach the computer, Miles shouted, Wait! How can you give such an important task to a student? If he messes up, we'll lose the order! Miles, Aiden is no ordinary student. Well, he looks like a child, Miles said with a sneer. And no offense, but he doesn't strike me as the reliable type. Miles looked at Aiden's clear skin and felt a prick of jealousy. A person's reliability is shown through their actions, not their looks, and certainly not their words, Aiden said plainly. He didn't have time to waste arguing. He put his hand on Miles' shoulder. Ding! Activate beginner level arm strength. Miles felt something gripping his shoulder a vice. He was dragged out of his seat by Aiden. Bastard! Miles was about to raise his fist and teach this kid a lesson when Mr. Walker shot him a warning glance. He stopped, but said fiercely, Okay, let's see how awesome you are then. Aiden wasn't paying attention to Miles anymore. Instead, he walked behind the counter. His eyes focused on the computer in front of him, and the system's voice sounded again. Ding! Proficient computing ability has been triggered. Scanning the computer. Three malfunction points have been found. Repairing success rate is 95%. Please confirm if you would like to continue with the repair. In his mind, Aiden asked the system, Is there a way to fix the computer without turning it on? Ding! Your request has been received. Adjusting plan. Ding! With your current computing ability, the success rate of repair without activation is 70%. Would you like to continue with restoration? Only 70%? Did that mean that there was a 30% chance of failure? Mr. Walker valued this order so much. Aiden didn't want to disappoint him. He couldn't accept a 30% chance of failure. System, how much computing ability do I need to fix this computer with a 100% chance of success? Ding! Running data analysis. Results indicate that 20 additional computing ability points are required. Aiden frowned. He currently had 15 points, which meant he needed to reach at least 35 points. But where was he going to find these 20 computing ability points now? Mr. Walker, do you have any computer books in your shop? Mr. Walker was stunned. Yes, but why do you need them? It doesn't matter. I need these books now. Lots of them. Bring me everything you have. Mr. Walker scratched his head as he set about collecting books. As an IT teacher, he had quite a lot of them. He carried a large pile over to the counter and set them down in front of Aiden. Under the gaze of Miles and Mr. Walker, Aiden sat down and started flipping through the books one by one. Aiden, I've read all of these books. There's no record of how to conduct repairs in this way. Mr. Walker couldn't help but point out. Aiden placed his index finger in front of his lips, indicating that he didn't want to be distracted. He then focused all of his attention on flipping quickly through the pages. Ding! Reading a computer textbook. Computing ability, plus one. Current progress, 16 out of 100. Current level, proficient. Ding! Reading a PS Theory course book. Computing ability, plus one. Miles watched as Aiden turned a page, scanned it quickly, and then turned another. He whispered into Mr. Walker's ear, What is this? He smiled mockingly as he pointed at his head. Is there something wrong with his mind? Mr. Walker didn't say anything. He just frowned. He didn't know what Aiden was up to either. Aiden heard what Miles said, but he didn't bother to look up. Twenty minutes later, he finally turned to the last page of the fifth book in front of him. Ding! Reading database principles. Computing ability, plus one. Current progress, 35 out of 100. Target achieved. Aiden put down the book and scanned the computer again. As expected, the success rate had increased to 100%. Ding! The repair plan has been sent. Aiden received the information in his mind and nodded silently. He said calmly, Mr. Walker, could you please lend me another computer? Before Mr. Walker could say anything, Miles said mockingly, Why? Can't you find a solution in the books? Are you going to search online now? There's no point. I've already tried all the online solutions. None of them worked. Aiden glanced at Miles coldly and said, I believe I was talking to Mr. Walker. I'll let you know when I want your input. Miles' eyebrows raised in indignation. He was livid. 
Ding! Counterattack, taunting, plus one. Current progress, one out of a hundred. Current level, beginner. <laughs>